Hi there, and welcome to Tech Tips Tuesday, your weekly insight into practical IT security. Today's tip, secure your remote access. RDP isn't set and forget. Remote desktop protocol is still widely used for accessing on-prem systems, especially in remote and hybrid environments. But RDP is also one of the most targeted entry points for attackers. If it's not properly secured, it can invite brute force attacks, credential stuffing, or even ransomware. Here's how to harden your RDP setup. First, never expose RDP directly to the Internet. Always place it behind a VPN or an SSH tunnel. Second, change the default port from 3389 to a non-standard port to avoid automated scans. Third, enable network-level authentication so credentials are required before a session is established. Limit who can access via RDP, avoid using administrator accounts, and enforce account lockout policies to prevent brute force attempts. Audit RDP logs regularly using Event Viewer or SCIM tools to detect suspicious behavior. Use multi-factor authentication whenever possible with solutions like Duo or Azure MFA. And most importantly, keep systems patched. Vulnerabilities like BlueKeep continued to be exploited long after they were disclosed. Why this matters? Even a single exposed RDP port can be scanned thousands of times a day by bots. A few configuration changes can transform RDP from a major risk into a secure remote access solution. Bonus tip? Use tools like Microsoft's Attack Surface Analyzer or Shodan.io to check your exposure. You might be surprised by what's visible from the outside. That's your tech tip for today. Lock down your remote access before someone else walks through it. Need help managing your RDP? We're here to help. See you next Tuesday. Please give us a call at 800-741-8530 or book a discovery call online at infotech.com slash discovery.